COVID-19 pandemic has affected all types of travel over the past year, but perhaps cruising most of all. In North America and around much of the world, cruise ships have been on pause since the coronavirus lockdown began last March, leaving people who love cruises wondering if they'll ever get back on ships again. This begs the question, could one year without cruises turn into two? At Cruise Critic, we don't think that's the case. Here are three reasons we're feeling optimistic and one reason that gives us a little pause. Reason number one, ships are sailing already. What many people don't realize is that in areas of the world where COVID-19 cases have declined, cruises have successfully resumed with new safety protocols. Royal Caribbean's Quantum of the Seas, for example, is having a very successful season in Singapore, offering cruises to nowhere for Singaporeans only, and with passengers giving higher satisfaction scores than ever before. In Europe, several cruise lines have been sailing off and on since last summer, and some small ship cruise lines in North America are already planning to sail at least part of the 2021 season in places like Alaska and the Mississippi River. Reason two, vaccines. While many nationalities, British and American for example, still have restrictions on where they can travel, the rapid rate of vaccination in both countries is promising and has led to a significant spike in cruise bookings. Some small and luxury cruise lines are requiring passengers to get vaccinated before they go, while others are making sure that the crew all get the jab. Both cruise lines and passengers are vocally confident that a quick vaccine rollout will mean that at least a partial cruise season is possible in 2021. Reason number three, health and safety protocols. Cruise lines have spent a lot of time, money, and effort putting together comprehensive health and safety protocols designed to protect passengers from COVID-19. Many of these innovations actually make the sailing experience a little better. You'll likely be able to board your ship now without as much hassle, for example, or even skip a visit to the purser's desk. And while you might have to wear a mask and social distance for a little while, cruises still offer people a lot of bang for their buck. You still have live music and theater, a choice of excellent restaurants and bars, and many of the cruise activities that you love. Of course, the entire COVID-19 pandemic has been unpredictable. There are scenarios that could keep cruise lines from resuming before the end of the year. The virus could mutate into a variant that is resistant to vaccines, for example. This would continue the cycle of lockdowns and travel restrictions and delay restart approval from the CDC and other international governments. The bottom line here is that we are confident that cruise ships will return to service before the end of 2021. Now, while that comeback might not be as quick as cruise fans would like, the current vaccine rollout, as well as new health and safety procedures, is definitely the shot in the arm that the industry needs. But we want to know, do you think cruising will return in 2021? Let us know what you think in the comments and click on one of the links below to stay up to date with cruising's return.